Mahalo from the beautiful community of Stinson Beach, California. You're of course watching Going Green with Dan. And I am here today to talk about the tragic, incredibly tragic events that we call the environmental community um, second holocaust. It's the tragic events of November 11th, 2007. And cut. As I was saying, the tragic events of November 11, 2007 have been burned into the memories of every shorebird along the stretch of coast, every fragile marine mammal. And I'm here today to do my part in our beautiful community to clean up bird by bird, well, maybe one bird, think um, the, the terrible effects of this environmental holocaust. I've come with my simple green and my non-toxic recycled um, paper towels and I am going to show you guys what you could do to help save our fragile ecology. Here we are at Stinson Beach. We're here to find some distressed ducks and save their little lives. Hold this. And can you go look for the, the ducks, please? Yeah. Just leave it. Have you seen any distressed animals while you were at the beach today? No. Do you believe that they actually exist? Yes. Now, this blonde girl's made an excellent point that although we can't see any of the animals that are in distress, they probably do exist. What do you think about the oil spill? Um, how did you feel when you first heard about this film? Um, I didn't feel anything. I felt fine. Dead inside? No, no. <laughs> it was not that big of an oil spill. <laughs> did you know that Santa Barbara produces that much oil in a month of natural seepage? That is? Did you out know that? Out of an oil well? No, out of natural seepage in Santa Barbara. It naturally seeps out of the ground. That's why they drilled down there. You didn't know that? I see what you're saying. No, I didn't, but I well, if you look, I'm glad if, I'm doing this. If you, go to the, if you go to the Museum of Natural History in Santa Which Barbara, uh, there's a Natural History any Museum down there, and the Indians used the oil that washed up on the beaches for all sorts of things, and that's before there was cars or anything. Uh, this whale has something very important to say about the the, um, I'd like to call it the silent fall. And it's not, I love you, Cheryl. It's, oil spills, oil spill sucks. Not oil spills, sucks. oil spill sucks. Are you allowed to use the word sucks? Yeah. Okay. Did you see any uh, animals that were in terrible distress? Yeah. What kind? Mostly seagulls and sea lions. Goes and flows of angel hair and ice cream castles <laughs> in the air and feathered cats. I've looked at clouds that way, but now. Sir, can I talk to you about the tragic oil spill of November 11th? Sir, so many things I would have done, but clouds got in my way. There were more dead birds on the beach when the government subsidized the Vietnamese immigrants with fishing boats and gave them fishing nets and in the indiscriminately. The White Vietnamese people. government? No, the American government. Vietnamese. <laughs> that oh, came over from Vietnam. Uh, I'm also interested in golfing. Are you? Oh, the, now you now you tickled my feather. Put your back into it. Oh yeah, and where where will we see it? Uh, on the worldwide. Is there a website like a www. 
by www.blogspot.green. Oh, okay. Environmentalism. <laughs> All right. <laughs> cool. <laughs> no, what is the last part? Dot environmentalism. Dot. I think. Well, something like that. You'll find it.